Hi everyone, I um, just got home. I went to do a Primark shop for my holiday that's coming up to Florida. As we are going to Disney, I cannot wait. So obviously you can see the power pipe behind me. Uh, I just thought I'd give you a little haul, what I got, how much things were. And yeah, I have actually got some videos for you that I did whilst I was in Primark, so I can show you everything on that. So I will be posting that up for you as well. But I just thought I will come on here, show you what I got and yeah. So let's get started, shall we? Oh, it's exciting. So, first of all, I got this lovely light dress. I'll come around and show you a bit. In fact, let's move this. Coffee table. I got this pink dress. Very light. I actually thought these were see-through, but I tried it on and you can barely see anything under it. Yes, you can see my hand because it's light, but because obviously I've got light underwear on, <laughs> you can't see through it, which is really nice. And it's dead floaty as well, which is really nice because that means you can actually wear it out with just some light underwear, some lovely sandals, you know, especially when the sun's like it is at the moment, it's beautiful out at the moment. It is reading 17 degrees in my car. And it's only half tall, so it might be getting hotter by the afternoon, which is good. So yes, I got this. This was, I had to go up in the size because the boob part here on it, as you can see, it's got these bits where your bra sits. I tried a 16 on and it came here on me. It wasn't sitting right. I got an 18 and it sits underneath my bra, which is really nice. And it's got a stretchy back as well. And this one, it was seven pound. It's just lovely. You know, like when it's like one of these days like it is now, just put it on some sand, some like lovely black or gold or white sandals, your sunglasses on, and you sat outside in the beer garden. Oh, it'd be lovely for that kind of weather, which it is at the minute. I'm wearing this and I'm absolutely sweating. I've just took my trains off because I was wearing Converse um, to driving because I can't drive in sandals. I put my leggings on so I thought I might put this on, wear some, some sandals in a moment and go out for a walk while it's nice. But yes, I got this. And you know what? I saw the blue one and I had to have it because the blue one. So I have a rose gold pair of ears for Little Mermaid for when we move to Florida. It's exactly the same colour as this for the ears, but the actual, it's got rose gold detailing in. I thought this would be perfect wearing Magic Kingdom. Oh, it's so nice. So yes, I will just show you the next one like that. So yes, I had to have the blue one as well, didn't I? Yes, of course I did. <laughs> but yes, I got the blue one as well. It is so floaty, as I say. It's just, obviously, you can tie it here at the front, um, however tight you want it. I mean, it's not really got a tie to it, to be honest, but yeah, you can put it into a bow. But yeah, I've got an 18 in this one as well, because obviously, like I said before, it doesn't, the other 16 doesn't sit right, whereas this one does. So I had to have the blue as well, because I also have a blue pair of Cinderella ears as well, which would look so nice with this dress. And my other half has just bought me some white sparkly sandals, which will go perfect with this outfit. So yes, I had to have the blue one, didn't I? <laughs> and yes, they're both 17, £7 each, so it came to £14 for the two, which isn't bad for Primark. They're not very expensive. Now this I saw in the pajama section. I love it. It is a nighty. I love sleeping in nighties because it's so comfy. I don't like wearing trousers in bed. It's so uncomfortable. But yes, I had to have this in tie. And it's Disney. <laughs> so it's got the Mickey detailing in the middle here or here. And it's just it pink is my obviously favourite colour. But yeah, and it says Team Disney at the bottom here. Yes, I love it. I had to have it. This was £6 from Primark. Yeah, and it comes to my knees on me, so I did try it on to make sure. And it's humongous, as you can see. But I love having baggy, um, you know, clothing. Especially for the night time, because you just want to be in no comfort, don't you, really? <laughs> but yes, I got that. I also got this skirt in a size 16. Size 16? Oh, it was a size 16. Huh. I thought, oh no, it's a size 18. Wait, the tag. Oh, it's a size 18, but I'm a 16 thing for some reason. But yeah, I got this one in size 18, so it's got a zip. And me with Primark skirts with zips don't agree because they never do up. But this one I tried on and it's got a bit of elastic waist. So it's probably, it is really comfortable. I tried it on with a white t shirt over the top. And it looks really nice on. So I thought, I've got a couple of white Disney t-shirts. One says Bell of the Ball on it, the, the Disney castle. So I thought I could wear that, took it into this with some white sandals or white Converse, and it would look really nice in the parks. 
But yeah, it's like a, a, a felt fabric kind of skip. It's very light, it's like really light. And then it's like a felt underneath. So yeah, I thought I'd get some of them, put some anti-chafing shorts underneath because I do get chafing, I have big thighs, I've tried deodorants, I have tried creams, nothing works. And then I went into Marks and Spencer's not long ago and got some anti-chafing shorts. So I put them underneath my dresses and skirts now and they work a treat because they're actually called cooling pants. And basically the anti-rub anti shorts, they come to about here and they give a cooling sensation when it's red or out. So it doesn't, it stops you from chafing. So I've got a black, white, I've got a black, white and cream colour pair. So it's like a skin colour pair as well. So that'll go perfect underneath these. And I can't wait, but yes, this skirt is a size 18. Obviously it has got the concealed zip there, as you can see, just there. This was 11 pound, a bit expensive for a skirt, to be honest. I, th I actually thought the dresses would be more, but yes, I got this. I love it. It's perfect for summer days as well. Like I say, you can wear it with sandals. You can wear it with just trainers and a t-shirt or a vest top and it'll look lovely on. Um, I have got a video that I will share with you um, and I'll leave that down below so you can obviously check it out as well. And I will be posting it up as well for you to see because I did a little, little prime mark shop, didn't I? So yeah. And I showed quite a few, there was quite a bit of Disney in the Primark, to be fair. If you're a massive Disney fan like myself, it's perfect for you. That is definitely, but yeah, I do share some of that, share some of the price as well, so you can obviously have a look, see what they're like. But yeah, I got this one. That was £11. And then I just got a few other little bits. Um, I got some headbands. I've got a gold one. It's a three set, so you've got a pearl one, just there. You've got a gold one and you've also got this very glittery one, which I love because I actually have another wedding coming up because we actually went to a wedding on Saturday, just gone. Oh no, it's come loose. Oh no, it's fine. Let me wait. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, so I've got another sparkly one to wear now for go out and about. And then I had to get a foundation brush because my foundation brush has had it. I've had it years. So this foundation brush, it's called PS Face. It's a foundation brush. It's perfect for buffing and blending any foundation. It was £1.50, so it's not too bad. And then these headbands for the three were £3. So basically you get three and they're a pound each, but they come in a set of three, which is three. So yeah, three pounds. So yeah, not too bad. It's not a massive haul, but obviously I just thought I'd show you what the holiday bits I did get. Um, I have still got to get some more because I was going to Primark to get some shorts and did they have any? No, they didn't. I even went to Next, they didn't have any. I went to River Island, didn't have any. They had a load of Disney stuff in um, River Island, like they had hoodies, they had sweatshirts, they had t-shirts, and I think I've seen one on Brogan Tate's vlogs that she got from River Island, and it was actually in the shop when I saw it. Um, but yeah, so they didn't have any shorts in River Island. I even went to New Look, and they did have a load of summer stuff, in, but there was just, they had shorts, but they're like, sit here, and they're like dead short, and obviously I don't like my legs. So I like some shorts that come here at least, but I just don't like them, especially, you know, you've got rub chafing there, the no good, but that's all Primark had as well. Like none of the shorts suited me at all. And they seem to have like these denim ones at the minute where they're like puffy out, where they're like the proper old style ones. And I just, they don't sit right on me at all. It looks horrendous. So yeah, I got a skirt, got a couple of dresses, thank God, but yeah, so I've got a couple of dresses to wear in the parks while I'm at Disney in June, so yeah, not long. We've only got 70 days left to go now. And I've only got 36 work days left. Woohoo! <laughs> so yeah, stay with me. I will do some more vlogs. I will do some more Primark vlogs. Obviously, I've got to turn it back out as soon as I get some shorts and hopefully by the end of next month, fingers crossed. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. My name's Ashley. If you're new, please subscribe. It really helps out my channel. And I will see you soon for the next one. Have a great day and enjoy the sunshine. Bye!